today, we have the biggest news in iPad <laughs> since the iPad. iPad Pro. <laughs> Looks and like I need I to have to buy a bag to show it to you. An iPad with OS X. <laughs> We're gonna need a bigger sleeve. <clears throat> You're looking at it, it's the entire screen. <laughs> the iPad Vista Vision. <laughs> Is this uh, sponsored by Star Wars? It's coming in. Yes. Look at the speaker holes. <laughs> that's, that's the vent for the fan. <laughs> <laughs> the nine muffin fans for the A12 processor bank. Strange. Uh, three dots. What is the three dots? Multi touch on two separate hands. Slim. Runs really hot. Slim good body. Yep. As <laughs> hot <laughs> as the sun. You can cook on it. <laughs> it's the iPad cooker. The new induction screen technology. Perfect for the camper or RV. So no lightning. Hmm. Or if it has ports, they didn't show it. It is. It's just plain large. This is the iPad Pro. <laughs> so what size Much is that? It it's just under 13, it's probably. It's the most capable and powerful iPad we've ever created. <laughs> it is chalked full of amazing advanced technologies and innovations. To tell you all about it, I'd like to invite Phil Schiller up. Phil? Don't drop it, Tim. That'll be your developer's, developer's, <laughs> developer's you, moment. <laughs> well, good morning, everyone. Thank you. So what, where are we Thank at? You. Three three untucks and a tuck? I'm so excited. Two <laughs> untucks, one tuck. Okay. Tim Cook okay. only okay. tucked. It has a huge it's a lifestyle. No, the the other guy tucked. In an Talk, iOS device. Jeff Williams was on it has more power okay. and performance than any iOS device Not that ever I'm made it. either. Let's start with that display. Why make an iPad with a bigger display? With a larger display, well, think about the iPad from the very beginning. It's a magical piece of glass you hold in your hands. You can touch the software. You can touch the web pages we surf. We can touch the books we read. We can touch the documents we create. And it can do the things news looks like that on a, a smartphone big screen. can't do because yeah. it doesn't have to fit in your pocket. And it's thin and light enough to hold all day long so that it can do things that a notebook can't do. So with a bigger screen iPad, your TV shows and movies are more cinematic. The games we play are more immersive and powerful. And an iPad is always a multi-touch device. So now with the bigger iPad Pro, you can have a full-size software keyboard. So you can type in your documents with this great big keyboard. And keyboards can do many things, like be an amazing musical instrument. Yeah, somebody likes music. <laughs> we can do something on an iPad that you can't do on a notebook. And the new multitasking features in iOS 9 Slide over, split view, picture, picture. We're designed to make it look with this iPad <laughs> Pro in mind. They make it so much more productive and capable. So how big is the screen on the iPad Pro? It's 12.9 inches on the that rumors were very accurate. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why 12.9 inches? Well, here, let me tell you a little secret about its size. Let's put next to it our previous largest iPad. That's iPad Air 2. Mm. If you look at the width <laughs> of the iPad Pro, it is the same as the height of the iPad Air. And then we Why take that, that height applause? and we make a four by three ratio. And now you have an iPad big enough to run your full iPad Air That's apps interesting. with more room side by side. It ah. is an incredible display. It is 2732 by 2048 pixels. Do the math, it's 5.6 million pixels. Far more than on any iOS device before. In fact, that's even more pixels than a 15-inch MacBook Pro with Retina display. It is a beautiful display. Your photos will look amazing on it. Huge, incredibly detailed, rich colors. Your documents will be full size with laser-sharp text. 
and I'll say it again, watching movies on it is incredible. It's an amazing experience. This is the most advanced display we have ever built. It took some incredible innovation and technology. For example, we used the technology that we created in the iMac with Retina 5. I wonder how much of that case is battery. Right. Like the, the new quickly. We made it look beautiful with our photo alignment technique, which means it has great on-access contrast ratio. Well, especially with a res resolution that high. I mean, it's, it's going to be a huge material, burn. Which means we can light up the pixels quickly and have uniform color and brightness. And for the first time in an Apple display... I'd be shocked if they can't say it gets the same battery life as the Air. That means that if things aren't moving quickly on the display, we can slow right. it down and save energy. This is an amazing display. And yeah, it's pretty much all battery. Even more amazing. Yeah. I, got circuit, I got a circuit board right down the center, this and then the it's just battery. This is the A9X chip. It's our third generation 64-bit chip. We've doubled bandwidth to memory. We've doubled the read and write performance to flash storage. It is so fast. Every they room around this. So many pixels yep. to that the display. The new yeah. A9X is 1.8 times faster than the A8X it replaces. This is desktop class performance. <laughs> to compare what our team has done, our chip team is just on fire. Over the last five years, they've grown performance in the iPad 22-fold for CPU tasks. And graphics tasks are even faster. We've doubled the performance of graphics over the A8X. And over the last five years, this is unbelievable. Graphics performance has gone up 360 times. In short, that thing we were so excited about the last year is... In this year alone. Nothing. You combine that fast hardware with <laughs> great software. Like Although my kids still use the, metal the first iPad. Oh, yeah. Fantastic. Is that Minecraft goes just not, as fast? They're not showing the graph of 9.7 inch iPad sales over the past three, four years, though. So. No. And I think that's what this is responding to as well. It is faster yeah. than 80% of the portable PCs that shipped in the last 12 months. It's a nebulous comparison. CPU that, tasks that at begs graphics a follow -up. tasks, it's yep. faster than 90% of them. So, when you run tasks and applications... Okay, I assume BS use, on that number until they tasks. show how they example, calculated it. Yep. iMovie. Running iMovie on an iPad Pro delivers desktop class performance. With iMovie, you can now edit three streams of 4K video simultaneous. That's wow. incredible performance. And it's going to enable new classes of applications for iPad. For example, check this out. This is AutoCAD 360 from Autodesk. It's an incredibly powerful application. This image has 320,000 objects in its wireframe mesh. And you can zoom in and pan around it with buttery 60 frame per second smoothness, something you can't do Why doesn't he do it, PC. <laughs> that I don't understand. All day battery life. Ten he said you can. He didn't say you should. <laughs> got an amazing display, incredible performance. I don't understand. There's a lot of he stills here. Of his, of his eye, all these engineers backstage waving their hands. No, don't, don't show. No, no. <laughs> It'll hurt them. This display deserves a great sound system. And so for the first time ever in an Apple product, we now and have And it works on Mars, evidently. audio system. And it automatically bounces Quad speakers. the left and the right. Bring iPad Pro home. Holding the iPad. And it balances the frequencies between the top and the bottom dynamically to create a beautiful stereo sound. That state. was not rumored. And it yeah, we didn't hear about that. three times yeah. the audio volume of an iPad Air 2. You really have to listen to See, it. See, they're, they're making this and to compete with $600 and $700 Windows 10 tablets. So it really has to be spec'd out like a Windows 10 tablet. Yep. Most of which are actually really well made and very satisfying. But none, none are this thin. I'm sure none will be this, this build quality at the price they're going to offer it. I don't, obviously we don't know how much it costs, but it's got to be less than an iPad Air. Uh, uh, sorry, MacBook Air. It's kind of fun. Yeah. They're both just around a one and a half pounds, which is unbelievable because the iPad Pro has a 78% larger screen area. It has 360 times more graphics power. It is thin and light enough to hold all day and powerful enough to take everywhere. Whether you want to watch movies in the park, Edit yeah, you can go outside now location. and watch TV. <laughs> this is an amazing iPad. <laughs> Under an umbrella. <laughs> the story doesn't stop there. Let's go back to that software keyboard. It's a great keyboard 
It dynamically changes as we use different applications. And it's how most of us will type okay. on our iPad Pro. The questions are going to get forced. But types. because we're enabling mm. applications not possible before in an iPad, sometimes you like the convenience Force touch would suck of a physical on a keyboard. keyboard. At least mm -hmm. the way they've been so we're very so excited to tell you about a brand new accessory just for iPad Pro, and it's called the Smart Keyboard. Mm. And let's make a list of everybody who was complaining about the uh, Microsoft Surface Pro keyboard. This is unlike keyboard. any keyboard yeah. you've ever used before. <laughs> Never ever say a concept is Apple terrible because fabric. Apple might make one that fabric too. fabric creates the cover, but also forms the structure and the feel of those keys. And they feel really great to type on. They work Inside, nice, they're just not a real keyboard. It's a new Apple dome switch that we pioneered. It'll, it'll work great Apple. for the purpose it's it works articulated for. And it's great new smart keyboard. Which is so how having just a cover that you can type on. But connect the smart keyboard to your iPad Pro. But if you look closely, there are three new circles along the side of the circles. iPad Pro. This is a brand new connector technology. We call it the smart connector. <laughs> we call it, we call it incompatible with everything else. Magnetic, <laughs> the smart keyboard. So when you want to attach your iPad to the keyboard, you just slide it on it. And the software in iOS 9 automatically adapts and changes because it knows you want to use the physical keyboard versus the soft keyboard. So that's the new smart keyboard designed specifically for the iPad Pro. Could we see a lightning connector? Or is it, all, is it all through the smart? So that's mm. typing. They got to make Let's it easy to get files in and off of this thing. An illustration. Customers have created amazing works that's, of that's art. for the cloud, Andy. on their iPads with their fingers. iPads all about multi-touch, and we will continue to use our hands to I've looked at the cloud from both sides now, Alex. IPad. Both sides are filthy. But iPad Pro <laughs> to enable new classes of applications that require even greater precision ever possible before. A new level of precision and accuracy Stylus. that requires some amazing innovation. Yep. So we're yes. so happy to introduce to you another brand new accessory. As Steve Jobs says. I, yeah, I, I, Pro. Yeah. I'm trying to resist like yeah. Steve Jobs Here's would be stylus. rolling in his grave. It is like, oh my gosh, sweet. you've done everything I didn't want to do. <laughs> They didn't come out first Apple with the stylus. They come out with the stylus when pencil. it's ready. <laughs> right. And this Apple Pencil is packed with so much amazing <laughs> new technology. We have a great video to tell you all about it now. You know, I will say low latency pressure sensitivity would be enough. Like, I'd be very excited about it. Because I just can't find a pen that I'm, that I'm happy with. Yeah. And I have bought all of them. To enhance what's possible with multi-touch and to allow... Remember that the first Surface, 3, uh, first Surface uh, tablet... Even though it wasn't a great device, well, artists loved it because it was like having a Cintiq tablet yeah. because it had that 1024 pressure sensitive stylus on it. Right. All it had to do was run Photoshop and uh, system of the display uh, an anime studio. Right. And this could be this could be really huge. I was I would be disappointed if they were just doing like a handwriting stylus. The system right. scans twice as often, allowing iPad Pro to capture more points in a single stroke. I'm trying out a, uh, sensors, uh, a couple of a, a couple of Windows tablets where Work again it works for the stylus, but it's really just for Evernote to writing. Position. You're missing such a big trick; you can't be creative with this. Oh, it looks like angle yeah. sensitive sensitivity. Oh, this is looking sexy it's as hell. You can <laughs> <laughs> we'll give you a moment, Guess Andy. What? We'll Guess what? I, I, I didn't spend nine hundred dollars flying out to San Francisco for this, but that means I have nine hundred dollars to spend on this. <laughs> I think I, I think I'm gonna Scott. Born this. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> I, I'm actually four blocks away from the Fifth Avenue Apple store. I can probably be there in the next 25 minutes. <laughs> it to be used simultaneously with your finger. Wait, what, what, was that an on screen? What, what kind of ruler was that? It has a responsiveness that feels like a uh, great for the China, Chinese market right there. Instrument. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, I think I'm gonna have to have one of these. Must a lightning have lets you uh, lightning by plugging yeah. directly into iPad Pro. Oh, so there is a lightning. Yeah. Yep. But you have to put it in the right side, or else it gets stuck. Yeah, that, that's that's where it's mounted. You just have to have it sticking out at the bottom the whole time. Technology working with our most advanced multi-touch display, it delivers something extraordinary. Precision 
that actually gives you... So the stylus is... Between to touch a single... The stylus is extra? Or does the stylus come with the iPad? The stylus is extra? I'm sure it's extra. 